Hi, John. Welcome to our event today. Um, maybe we can start off by introducing yourself and your role within your organization. Yeah. So my name's John Marsh, and I'm the founder and the executive director of the Prosperity Initiative. Um, Prosperity Initiative, or PI, is, a, is an organization which is a spin-off from Oxfam. Uh, and we work in the bamboo sector, promoting and developing it for the benefit of the poor. Great, and could you explain your, the business model of a Prosperity Initiative and how it's an inclusive business? Yes, well, um, what Prosperity Initiative does is uh, we look for sectors which, uh, or, or market subsectors which the poor benefit from, either through sales of produce or uh, in job creation, and the bamboo sector is one of those. And then we work with the lead firms and governments who uh, have the power to shape that industry for the benefit of the poor, to grow that industry, to reach new market share. That's, that's what we do in a nutshell. Okay. And what are, the, some, what are some of the challenges your business is facing as, as you attempt to grow, and how do you plan to overcome these challenges? Well, um, I guess we are very young, we're only two years old. I think trying to explain to people who are, would support what we do um, we work a bit like a development organisation, we work a bit like a business, um, and that's a new modality. So to, to find finances, finances for our work is a challenge. Um, I think um, we're a start-up, everybody has these uh, start-up problems, building a team, working out how you're going to work. Um, but other than that, I think we've had uh, good success given we're so young. Great. And um, what does the future look like for Prosperity? I mean, what is the five or ten year sort of strategy? Well, I think what we really want to do is consolidate our work with Bamboo and get some real results. We've, we've got good early success with the transfer of technology from China and the first uh, pressed bamboo, which is this stuff here, which looks like wood, feels <laughs> like wood and, and uh, has the same value as wood. Yeah, it's the first pressed bamboo being made in Vietnam. We want to see that um, adopted by many other firms, and there's a bunch of other uh, similar products. So consolidate bamboo, get firms uh, producing and selling, consuming much more bamboo, increasing sales to farmers, and then uh, take those approaches to other sectors. So we've looked at tourism, for example, it's another important industry for the poor. Uh, we've got very good connections with tourism wholesalers who we think are the primary agents uh, in the private sector to help that industry. Great. And uh, finally, what is the best way that policymakers, other donors, and I guess other people can support you in your work? I think we share uh, the interests of policymakers and governments um, in terms of poverty reduction. Uh, what they could do, I think, is to take a sharper look at industries which help the poor, the poor more specifically and the businesses in those industries and allocate their efforts towards uh, the identification of those and supporting those uh, businesses which will, in the end, create um, a better impact uh, on poverty. Great. Well, thank you very much for your time. And again, we're really excited to have you here. And thanks for coming to, all the way to London for this event. Uh, super. Thanks for the, for the uh, kind words, and I'm very happy to be here.